The HAL Tejas MK2 2025 represents a major leap forward for Indian aerospace technology and defense capability. Designed and developed by Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, this advanced multi-role fighter aircraft is a proud evolution of the original Tejas program. Combining agility, modern avionics and superior weapon systems with the vision of self-reliance in military aviation, the MK2 is not just a small upgrade, it's an entirely new generation of combat readiness for the Indian Air Force and Navy. The Tejas MK2 carries a much larger and more powerful engine than its predecessor, the GEF 414 GE NS6, which produces nearly 98 kN of thrust. This increase gives the aircraft significantly better acceleration, higher speed, and improved payload capacity. The additional thrust allows the MK2 to carry more fuel and weapon systems while maintaining impressive maneuverability one of the hallmarks of the Tejas platform. With a maximum speed of around Mach 1.8 and a service ceiling exceeding 50,000 feet, this aircraft can perform high-speed interceptions and deep strike missions with remarkable efficiency. In terms of design, the Tejas MK2 reflects a more mature and robust airframe. It has been stretched slightly to accommodate a larger internal fuel tank and upgraded avionics. The aerodynamic design has been refined with an emphasis on reduced radar cross-section, giving it limited stealth features. The blended wing body design, coupled with advanced composite materials, contributes to both strength and lightweight efficiency. These composites make up nearly 43% of the airframe, which helps reduce maintenance costs and enhance performance. The extended fuselage also allows for improved stability and space for additional systems, making it a true multi-role aircraft capable of adapting to different combat scenarios. One of the major highlights of the Tejas MK2 is its state-of-the-art avionics suite. The cockpit is fully digital, equipped with large area multifunction displays and a modern glass cockpit interface. The pilot is supported by a hands-on throttle and stick HODAS system, which enables more intuitive control during high-speed maneuvers. The Tejas MK2 also features a helmet-mounted display system, allowing pilots to aim weapons simply by looking at the target significantly enhancing reaction times and combat effectiveness. Additionally, the fly-by-wire control system has been improved for greater stability and agility, ensuring that even in extreme flight conditions, the aircraft remains responsive and safe to operate. When it comes to sensors and radar systems, the MK2 stands at par with modern 4th Plus generation fighters. It incorporates an advanced ESA radar, active electronically scanned array, capable of tracking multiple aerial and ground targets simultaneously. This radar provides high detection range, superior tracking accuracy, and resistance to jamming, an essential feature in modern warfare. The aircraft also integrates an infrared search and track IRST system, giving it the ability to detect stealth aircraft or heat-emitting targets without depending on radar emissions. Together, these systems allow the Tejas MK2 to dominate both in air-to-air -air and air-to-ground engagements. The Tejas MK2's weapons versatility is one of its strongest points. It is designed to carry a wide range of indigenous and international weapon systems, from precision-guided bombs to advanced air-to-air -air and air-to-surface missiles. The aircraft features 11 hardpoints, a significant increase from its predecessor's eight allowing it to carry more weapons or external fuel tanks for extended range. It can deploy missiles like Astra for beyond visual range combat, Python and Darby for short range engagements, and precision guided bombs such as the SAW, smart anti-airfield weapon. The MK2 also supports integration with future missile systems, giving it long-term adaptability and relevance in evolving combat environments. From a performance perspective, the aircraft has been engineered for both speed and endurance. It can cover an operational range of nearly 2,000 kilometers without refueling. And when equipped with drop tanks or mid-air refueling, its range can be extended substantially. The thrust-to-weight ratio has been optimized for both high-speed dogfighting and low-level ground attack missions. With its advanced digital flight control systems, the Tejas MK2 maintains exceptional agility capable of performing tight turns and complex aerial maneuvers that rival many modern fighters in its class. Safety and survivability are also key elements of the Tejas MK2's design philosophy. It includes modern electronic warfare, EW systems for countermeasures, radar warning receivers, 
and jamming pods to protect against enemy detection and missile threats. The aircraft's structure has been designed to withstand high G-forces and combat stress, ensuring durability under demanding missions. The cockpit canopy is reinforced for pilot protection, while the aircraft's onboard oxygen generation system provides sustained operation in high-altitude environments. In terms of production and strategic value, the Tejas MK2 represents a milestone for India's Make in India initiative. The majority of its components are sourced domestically, including radar systems, avionics, and structural materials. This not only boosts local manufacturing, but also reduces dependence on foreign suppliers, ensuring better cost efficiency and supply chain resilience. For the Indian Air Force, this aircraft will serve as a replacement for older platforms such as the Mirage 2000 and Jaguar, filling the medium-weight fighter category with an indigenous solution that meets modern combat demands. The Tejas MK2 also demonstrates India's growing expertise in modular aircraft design. This modularity allows for easier maintenance, faster upgrades, and adaptability for different mission roles, whether air superiority, ground attack, or reconnaissance. The open architecture software further ensures that future updates, new sensors, or weapons can be integrated without redesigning the entire aircraft, a critical factor for maintaining long-term combat effectiveness in rapidly evolving warfare environments. Another notable aspect is the aircraft's cost efficiency compared to foreign fighters. While offering advanced capabilities similar to modern fourth generation plus fighters, the Tejas MK2 is expected to cost significantly less to procure and maintain. This gives it a strong edge not only for India's defense requirements, but also as a potential export product to friendly nations seeking affordable yet advanced fighter solutions. Finally, beyond the numbers and technology, the HAL Tejas MK2 2025 stands as a symbol of national progress and engineering excellence. It represents years of innovation, testing, and refinement, resulting in a combat aircraft that can proudly stand beside international contemporaries like the F-16, Gripen, and Rafale. The MK2's combination of speed, versatility, and cutting-edge systems embodies the next chapter of India's journey toward full aerospace autonomy. The Tejas MK2 is not just a fighter, it's a statement of independence, power, and progress. It shows the world that India can design, develop, and produce advanced combat aircraft that meet the demands of 21st century warfare. Whether in terms of technology, adaptability, or operational capability, the 2025 HAL Tejas MK2 defines the future of Indian air defense and cements its position as a key player in the global aviation landscape.